Good afternoon, thanks for tuning in to Kalkine TV. I'm Holly and this is The Hot Performers, the show where we take a look at stocks and sectors that could be heating up. Today we have ASX listed company Simic Group under the spotlight. Simic, the engineering-led construction and mining services company, has announced that its financial results for the 12 months of December. The group highlighted that its net profit fell in 2021, but that it expects an increase this year after a significant recovery in new work. It also reported that the group's revenue has gone up by 8.3% to $14.7 billion. Simic saw a net profit of 402 million Australian dollars for the 12 months through December, as compared to a net profit of 620 million in 2020. So that said, let's have a closer look at the financial insights provided by the company. Simic Group declared the final dividend of 336 cents per share, I should say, and a total dividend of 78 cents per share, representing a payout ratio of 60% in the financial year 21 results. It also reported that the operating cash flow pre-factoring improved by $603 million compared to the financial year 20. Statutory net profit as well after tax of $402.1 million was however down by 35.2% in comparison to the previous fiscal year, whereas about $620.1 million. And according to their latest ASX release, the financial year 21 guidance has been met and the company is of the view that the guidance of financial year 22 will be supported by a strong level of work and hand positive medium term outlook across the group's core markets. And it looks like Simic is on the road to recovery as the company highlighted a significant bounce back from 2020 to above and beyond pre-COVID-19 levels as new work worth $20.4 billion was awarded in the financial year 21. Construction, services and investments order book were well diversified as well. Major contracts that were announced in the financial year 21 included country regional network projects in New South Wales worth $1.5 billion. Sydney Metro Western Sydney Airport Station boxes and tiling works in New South Wales worth $1.35 billion and the M6 Motor Stage 1 in New South Wales as well, worth 1.95 and others. Simic Group's Chief Executive Chairman and Chief Executive Officer Juan Santa Maria was quite satisfied with their performance. It was stated that Simic achieved a solid 2021 financial results with NPAT within the team's guidance range and total dividends of 78 cents a share, increased work in hand and a significantly improved EBITDA cash conversion. They also shared that the diversified group's funding sources completed their strategic unwinding of factoring and the prepaid and discontinuing of supply chain finance programs. The CEO also put forward that the group is proud of its significant contribution to job creation and national prosperity. Simca is set to focus on managing working capital, generating sustainable cash-packed profits and a rigorous approach to tendering project delivery and risk management in the upcoming year. Simic shares witnessed a fall of 6.34% today and they were trading at around $16.01. Well, that is all for now on the Hot Performers, but tune in next time only on Calcine TV. This is Holly Shields signing off.